Three easy ways to get passive income. Check this out. We all want that passive income so we can get some extra money in the door so we can eventually get to the place where we obtain financial freedom. So what are three easy ways you can do it? Well, let's start with this one. Number one, rental properties. Now, going out and buying a property by yourself might take a little bit of work. Not too hard, can be done, but it might take a little bit of work. If you don't want to do that, you can just as easily invest with people that already own properties. I own one called Knife, where you can own a piece of big apartment buildings, $400. There's Fundrise and there are other ones like it. So you simply put in a little bit of money and you get your passive income relative to your ownership share in the property. Easy and simple, right? Way number two that you can do it. This is something you can do right away. Any type of investment app, go in there and you can get index funds. S&P 500 ETFs, which are tied to the economy at large. Historically over the past 100 years, they've compounded by close to 10% every single year. Meaning, and this is actually Warren Buffett's favorite investment strategy, that if you just put your money in there and you invest something every single month, not only does your nest egg grow, but so do your returns because they compound. Let's say you have $100 and you get 10% return on that, you have 110. Year number two, you get 10% return on 110, not just 100. See how this works? And this is how it snowballs like an avalanche. Before you know it, you have a ferocious snowball coming down with all the money that you can ever count. All right? Now, easy way number three, REITs. REIT stands for Real Estate Investment Trust. It's basically a company that is publicly traded. It can be private too, but mainly publicly traded that own commercial real estate properties. It can be anything from malls. It can be hospitals. Of course, multifamily, which is apartment buildings, anything that you can imagine. Now, these REITs, here's why this is a good way to make, you know, passive income. By law, the REITs have to pay out 90% of their income in dividends, meaning that those dividends are passed down to the shareholder, i.e. you, if you buy it. See what I'm saying here? So, that's one way you can get some extra income if you have this. And there's a nice, cool little diversification of relatively low-risk equities that are out there. So let's recap. One, rental properties. Two, S&P 500 ETS, i.e. index funds. Three, REITs, real estate investment trusts, because they're required to pay out 90% of the income and dividends, so this benefits you, the shareholder. And those are the ways you can make some extra money.